we've got kitchen gardens at L'Ermitage Pontoise by Camille Pizarro here. Pizarro frequently painted the traditional peasant gardens of L'Ermitage, his home during the 1870s in the market town of Pontoise in northern France. It is hard to imagine from this tranquil early autumn scene with its ordered cycle of harvesting, preparation for market and ploughing, that the preceding months had been a roller coaster of emotions and personal crisis for Pizarro, including the death of his daughter. In this humble work, Pizarro places a bed of blue-green cabbages right in the center foreground. They are echoed by the blue roof beyond, whose red chimney implies a hearth and cooking pot. The soft blue-violet shadows of the cabbages, imbued with reflected light, link visually with the blue sky, roofs and peasants' aprons, as well as with the acid green vegetables and fens to the right. The golden corn introduces a contrasting group of warm colours, rich browns and red roof, whilst little bath-coloured areas provide a sort of bridge between cool and warm notes. In this impressionistic open composition, Pizarro emphasizes the accurate depiction of light in its changing qualities, while accentuating the effects of the passage of time. Pizarro loved autumn, considering its golden light and changing colors far more interesting than what he later described as the solid, monotonous green of summer. Traditional rural gardens like those at L'Hermitage fed their peasant owners first, and only what remained was sold. This imagery of rural self-sufficiency can be related to the utopian ideals of the socialist Pierre-Joseph Proudhon, who was much admired by Pizarro. This area of Inverleith and Goldenacre was well known in the past for its nurseries, with fruit trees, plants and plants for medicine. This is a charming rural painting of people working quietly, methodically and probably hard amongst the cabbages and all the other essential vegetables and fruits of the kitchen garden. France is still famous for its potagers, but this is one of the essential kitchen gardens of the north of France producing food for the Pontoise area. Pizarro has cleverly used the lovely bluey greens of the cabbages in the picture. And there are fruit trees and possibly poplars near the back, but it is after leaf fall. So are the women packing fruit into the baskets? And what is the donkey going to take to market? There must be leeks, carrots, beetroot, turnips, potatoes and other winter vegetables, but some will already be lifted and stored. Here at the Botanics you can enjoy seeing what our horticultural students have grown on their small allotment plots and how individual they can be. But we can also see the cabbage plot here with its typical wild field flowers and precious Shetland cabbage, specially grown this season. So if anyone's hungry, <laughs> it's a as you go along. <laughs>